I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. The Arcane Mage is coming on great. Things have been a little bit hard for me in the past couple of days, but we've been farming on some gear. Going mostly for two trinkets and a tier set. Hope you guys enjoy the video and have a wonderful day. It's time we check our vault. Let's hope we get something good. If we don't get something good, you know what? It's not the end of the world, but I really am hoping for something good. I feel like getting 1k IO in one day was pretty it was pretty nice to have that is a tier set piece there isn't really anything here of value realistically i feel like i might just take the tier set piece just to have it like yeah 509 like wrists the hero yeah i'm probably just gonna take the tier set piece this would be good but i can get that like just doing dungeons so i'm gonna take the tier set piece just for an upgrade have it now, just so we can get tier set. Realistically, what we want from this is the tier set piece, the trinket, or the uh, chronograph. I'd prefer the trinket or the headpiece, but the chronograph would be good as well. We didn't get any loot from that Fryat kill, but we did get another Boolean. That means we are at four now, which is great. Let's hop into another LFR. Picking up the Vessel of Searing Shadow, and then I'm also going to go ahead and pick up the other flame ring, which is another upgrade, the seal of Phileo Duty. And then there's also a weekly event to do four mythic dungeons, which will get me another two bullions. We are looking good, really good. Hey, you know what? 100K DPS on this boss, beautiful. Not gonna lie, didn't expect to do that much damage, but that's a good amount to come out. And we're actually going to get a chest piece drop, which we don't need. Heading into a plus two Azure Vault. Looking forward to getting the trinket. That is our main goal right now, to get the trinket. Would be great. But just want to just wanna get better now. We've got some gear upgrades, so we should be looking good, really. Like our damage should be better here and we should like pop off a little bit more and stuff like that. I do not want to waste my spells and stuff yet, but I can already feel my damage slightly increasing here. Like not an incredible amount, but just a little bit. Like it feels good. Hey, top DPS on that trash. <laughs> nice. Nice. No 117k overall damage on that boss. This uh, Guardian Druid. 117k overall. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. 88k damage on the last boss. 50 IO and 112k overall with no drop. We are here returning to Nelphorus. Is it Nelphorus? Nelphoros? However you want to say it. Plus two. I need my tier set. I need it soon. Don't know how I'm going to get it, but I need it. Ah, 87k DPS while getting heavy carried by the group leader. Ah. Ah, that's that's not good. <laughs> that's really not good. He was pumping. 105k overall damage. Let's hope we don't get a drop. <laughs> 105k total overall damage though is nice. Improvements are coming soon, TM. I have no idea what this event is, but we're going to go ahead and do it. It's some, I think it's the fire festival or something like that. So let's hope we get something cool from this. I'm going to take the uh, blue tabard because it reminds me. It reminds me of the Mr. Pandaria transmog for challenge mode. Oh, I wish I had that. It, it's such a beautiful transmog. Oh, I get both. Why? <laughs> Why let me pick if I just get both? Let's hope the Satchel of Chilled Gods has some gear in it. It'd be nice. It probably won't, but let's hope. I'm an idiot. Of course it doesn't. It's a it's an event. Why would it have gear in it? Heading into a plus two. 
Knock on defensive. Still don't have any tier set pieces. It's Sunday night. Still taking a little bit of time away from WoW to work on some things in my personal life. But I'm getting a little bit better. Things haven't been the best, but... Thanks, Ed. But it's always good to talk about your like feelings and stuff. So if you've got problems going on, make sure you uh, talk to your friends. Jesus, that was a messy dungeon. 47 IO and a weapon we do not need. Heading into a plus two ruby life pools. Let's hope the uh, tank is skin? gonna do a big pull. Be nice if he does, then we can get our Zug Zug DPS out. Never mind, we have a 2.7k IO Feral Druid who's just cleansed everything. And that is our weekly quest done. Another 50 IO. Plus 50 on Ruby Life Pools. Thank you, champion. And 50 gold as well. Thank you for a great run. Let's cheer for everybody. <laughs> God, it's so weird using emotes, but that was a good run. With me completing that weekly quest, I've gone ahead and I've purchased the Necklet from Imidrasil with my Bouleons. It's a great upgrade. And I do believe it does sync with the rings that I have as well and should be a really good item to keep. We're going to upgrade it, stick some settings on it and get some gems. I have just placed three plus 70 critical strike and plus 33 mastery gems in my necklace. I would say the full name of the gem but I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Sen says I can do that. The second part, <laughs> hell no. <laughs> I'm not even going to embarrass myself by trying to say that. Jumping into the worst dungeon of the season. A plus three. Uderman, please. Run. If there is a god, smite me down for how many times I've wasted in this dungeon. Sorry, how much time I've wasted. I hate returning here. I hate coming here, but we have to. We've got to get our IO up as much as possible. Hey, you know what? 170k total damage for that boss. Pretty, pretty good. Not, not too shabby. Getting better. Getting better. Oh my god, we've actually managed to get ourselves into a high key. I think this is like a six or a four. You know what? I throw myself into so many applications and hope I get into them. Nope, it is a six. Let's hope. Let's hope. Keystone Challenger. 106. I O, some gold, but you know what? We did terrible that run. Like, I'll own up to that. I did awful. But 150k overall is at the end. 50 IO, we managed to plus three that. My overall damage was pretty awful, but a pair of boots, which is a massive upgrade. I did really poor that run. I feel so bad for that group, but they were freaking awesome. Just completed a world quest for some 454 four shoulders. I still haven't got a pair as a drop. I still don't have tier set pieces. A 496 trinket is not bad. I'm spending a little bit of my upgrade stuff too. So I'm spending a little bit of fly stones on the possibility of some gear. A 496 weapon. That would have been good previously, but just gonna buy one more because we're gonna be farming keys anyway so let's buy three pieces i'm just hoping for shield or shoulders or anything i don't know why i said shield but 496 gloves that's an upgrade that we can turn to a tier 10. <laughs> hallelujah 496 shoulders i thought you know what i'm gonna take the risk i'm gonna spend some more that's great realistically all we need is some legs and we can get a four tier set piece bonus Nine of the Awakenings, which we're going to just make a full tier set right now. Or a two piece because I can't do it with the legs because they're heroic pieces. So we're going to go ahead and just make this right now. It's a massive, massive upgrade for us to have, no matter what. Someone's going to be like, oh no, you're just wasting them. You're just doing this, you're doing that. It's vital that we get our tier set right now. Heading into a plus four, Brackenite Hollow, with our upgrade. We should do better. Sadly, our last key fell through. Five, so we're moving on four, to three, another two, plus. I think this one. is like a plus four or a plus five. 
Dragonite Hollow. The group's looking pretty good. And my damage is looking even better. Like 145k? Pretty, pretty good. You know what? 164k overall DPS on that boss fight isn't too shabby. Plus 5, no Pharos. Great, great dungeon. Been taking a little bit of time away from WoW recently. Had, you know, lost my cat. Mentally, I've just been a bit stressed out and stuff. But WoW has always just been a great little uh, getaway and a little break from things. So I appreciate WoW sometimes, you know, Shall and I hope we? you guys are happy and I hope you guys are staying safe. Yeah, I love it. Love it when my PC basically crashes from overheating. Americans, you guys can laugh because, you know, UK houses are a bit of rocks and we have no air conditioners. You have permission to laugh. Don't worry. You hate it when, like, you're in a key and something like that happens and you're just, as well, because you're under gauge, you're underperforming. You feel bad. You're like, oh, these guys are putting in so much effort and I've just basically ruined it for them. Like, they probably wanted to plus three this and I've just completely just fucked them over. So I feel, <laughs> I feel hella bad on this part. There we go. Plus five, no for us done. I did appalling there. I need to work on my, uh, I need to work on things, but 52 gold and let's swap our key to something else. Looks like we're heading into a horse of infusion. I'm going to do bad DPS this run. I'm going to. I promise. I promise. I, I promise I'm going to do bad DPS. I really do. <laughs> What the fuck? Well, that went, uh, that went well. Well, it wasn't that long for us to get into another key, at least. We got straight into another Halls of Infusion. Let's get right into it. Let's hope this key wasn't as bad as the last one. Or isn't, sorry. Isn't as bad as the last one. Hey. <laughs> one point... 5k io achieved plus 82 on a halls of infusion wicked no loot once again it is wow. time for brackenhide hollow one of the only keys i actually do need to do this week probably gonna get a drop if we time it that'd be great i just died to the totem landing and exploding but that is 191 io a plus five brackenhide hollow Let's hope we get a rest so we can get some loot, shall we? Time for a plus six knock on defensive. Five, this four, is three, a three, dungeon that has one. some good loot for us. Also has some bad loot, so let's see what happens. Oh my god, who are you? Oh! Some fucking cat just fucking walked into my kitchen and was like, sup? And then just walked out. When I do get into situations like this, like where I'm really underperforming, but everybody's in the same kind of gear as me, it just kind of makes me feel a bit lackluster, you know, like, oh, I could be doing better here, I, I could be performing better, but it's just the premise of, like, you know, I'm learning. Like, there's nothing I can really do about that. Like, shit, if I, if I could do better, I, I would bloody do better. But sadly, <laughs> I'm not, so you win some, you lose some, right? Second to last boss down, 106k overall DPS. I leave this up now so you guys can see like what my damage is and stuff like that. I do want to do an Azure Vault soon to try and get that trinket. That'd be really good. But let's hope something drops from here. Ah, uh, you know what? Sadly, we uh, didn't time that key, but we still got 48 IO and hopefully we'll get a drop. The worst thing to come out of that was, uh, yeah, the, uh, the priest died four times back to back to back. All of our battle reses were wasted on the final fight, so you win some, you lose some. Let's move on to another dungeon. Sadly, still no drop. <laughs> I do need to upgrade some of my awakened gear. I know I could just get some hero pieces eventually, like hero weapons and stuff in the future, but I'd like just to get them upgraded now, just for the sake of it, so I can get them like rounded up and they're looking a bit better for future groups and stuff like that. I don't know what this is. You might have to explain this to me in the comments. I have two 502 rings in my bags, yet I can't upgrade these for free, like just using flight stones. Is that because they're champion and these were awakened? If you do know the answer to that, like, you know, leave me a comment, please. I'd greatly appreciate that. That would really help. 
So it's about an hour or two later since my last key. We're heading into a plus four as your vault. Hoping for the trinket would be nice. Yeah, the uh, tank missed the route. So we're having to uh, go back to the start and just uh, kill some stuff. And there we go. Plus two. Wicked. Love to see him. 20 IO. 1.76 K IO. Things are, things are finally picking up. Yeah, my damage still isn't the best, but we are. <laughs> We're picking it back up at least. Ooh. That's what we wanted. The Tome of Power. Let's go. That's what we came here for. It's not the hero version, but that's what we wanted. Heading into another dungeon. A plus five. Ruby five, life balls. Four. This tome is going to help me so much. I'm getting close to having all my best in slot in non-hero form, but I'm getting close to having all the items that I will need in the future. That is another 45 IO. Plus two in game, plus five ruby life pools. 53 gold. Ooh. Maybe this guy might not need the cape. That would be great. So this cape isn't a massive upgrade and it's not a best in slot but it is an upgrade nonetheless we will end up eventually replacing it but it is good to have for now like i needed to get rid of that previous cape i had which was 476 i'll take it for now five, heading into a plus five four, alderman three, let's hope two, my group one. actually allows me to get my aoe's off at the start because i feel like some of these tanks are pulling in little segments little segments little segments and they don't really get you the time to get the rotation off or i'm just really really fucking bad which is probably the latter but you know let's keep going you know what 190k on that boss that's great what did most of my damage come from arcane missiles great barrage and barrage not too shabby not too shabby keeping up with this uh, destruction warlock at least Dear God, I don't want to talk about that. I should have done a lot better DPS on that boss. A lot better. Where is it? Yeah, 163k. I should have done a lot better on that. A lot better. And there is Alderman done at plus five. Oh, 1,854 IO. And a pair of freaking legs. 476 legs. Replace. Obliterated. Gone. Praise the Lord. Thank God. I'm so happy about that. Getting this, this replaced is beautiful. I'm so happy. I'm, that's great. I think that's a great way to end the video, but I think we can slide a few more dungeons. Upgrading my Dream Binder Loom of the Great Cycle. I hate when WoW gives items mega long names, but we're upgrading it to 8 out of 12. I was going to go for nine out of 12 but there is some crafted gear that i want to get so we're gonna save a bit